Governor Huckabee. Nikki Haley, Republican governor from South Carolina, recently said. Me, did you miss me? Did you skip me? Uh, I did not, but I'm we have, have something to say about it. You just keep you. going. You, you bet, Governor. Yeah. We, we have a couple more in the hopper for you in a yeah, moment here. Yeah, I'll be there. Uh, first, Governor, Governor Huckabee. Uh, Nikki Haley warned about listening to the, the siren call of the angriest voices, to which Donald Trump said he is very, very angry. Who's right, Governor? A lot of Americans are angry. And I think it's important to understand why they're mad. They're mad because they see a government that continues to do fine. They see people at the top. They're doing fine. But that person you asked Rick about a moment ago, that, that lady that's making 10,000 bucks a year, do you know what our poverty programs do to people? They keep them in poverty. They keep them in poverty because we have these arbitrary thresholds that mean that if you go to work, you lose all the benefits for your kids, Medicaid, WIC, Section 8 housing, food stamps, and then your kids go hungry. I know a little about poverty. My sister is here tonight, and the both of us could tell you, we did not grow up rich. My mother grew up in a house, oldest of seven kids. She had lived in a house that didn't have floors, just dirt. No electricity, no running water. I resent it when people say, oh, people are poor because they want to be. No, they're not. Nobody wants to be poor, and that's a stupid, foolish thing, mean thing to say. People are poor because they don't know how to get out of the hole. And government shouldn't push them back in the hole, which is what our policies do when they punish people who want to go to work and don't let them out. We can fix that, but it takes some leadership to get it done. Thank you, Governor.